in this example we are required to find the gravitational interaction energy of a system consisting of a disk of mass m and radius r and a point mass small m situated at a distance x from the disk center on its axis as we can see here so in this situation we can directly write that gravitational potential energy we can write as mv where m is the mass of this body and v is the potential at this point p due to the disk and if due to disk if v is the potential then we can directly write energy as mv and now to calculate the value of gravitational potential at p due to the disk we need to take a small elements within the disk like uh, at a radius y we consider an elemental ring within the disk surface which is of width dy so here we can uh, find out the mass of uh, this elemental ring as here if we calculate the mass of this elemental ring we can say mass of uh, elemental ring in the disk is this can be written as dm which is uh, m by pi r square multiplied by 2 pi y dy which can be written as uh, 2 m by r square y dy this is the mass of this elemental ring and uh, from this elemental ring every point is located at a distance of root of x square plus y square from this point m or the point p so we can write gravitational potential at p due to ring is this can be written as dv and we already discussed about the expression for gravitational potential due to a ring at an axial point so this can be written as minus g dm by root of x square plus y square if we substitute the value of dm it will be minus 2 gm y dy by r square root of x square plus y square if this dv then uh, total potential at point p due to disk is this v we can write as integration of dv if the same is integrated here minus 2 gm by r square as a constant we integrate y dy upon root of x square plus y square within limits from 0 to r as y is integrated from 0 to r so the integration of this term we can say as already we have taken integration if we substitute this denominator as a single variable this can be given as minus 2 gm by r square and it is root of x square plus y square and we apply limits from 0 to r if we substitute the limits the potential at point p we can write as this we are getting is minus 2 gm by r of first we substitute the upper limit it will be root of x square plus r square minus if you substitute the lower limit it will be only x this is a potential at point p and if it is vp then potential energy of point mass m located at p can be written as mvp so we can write potential energy of uh, mass m placed at point p is this can be written as ug as mvp so if we substitute the value it is minus 2 gm m by r inside bracket we can have root of x square plus r square minus x that will be the answer to this problem